Barcelona. Woo! So Garage was here for a couple of days before, yes. before, before, but I came here so I could see him for like 18 hours. Yeah, he's strong like that, I right? know. Yeah. Oh my Sorry. gosh, sister. Sorry. Flying back to Manila tomorrow, tomorrow, and I'll see him in a month or so. Mm -hmm. But of course, one last hurrah. So I survived today. I missed my bus because I accidentally. <laughs> I thought AM was PM, so oh God. yeah, I missed it. So I ended up taking a blah blah car all the way here, so I can make it. And girl, she's here tonight. I know I'm here. I see Ooh. you, darling. Bam, 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 bam. Oh my God, I look like super tourist. We are super touristy. It's funny <laughs> and cute. It's cute. It's so cute. cute. So. Until 12 o'clock before we check out, mm -hmm. um, we are shopping. We're gonna walk around. We're gonna walk around and shop. And then, yeah, Garage is gonna tour me because he's been shopping for days here. <laughs> For the run of your life. Iron Man can never. Okay, go. We're breaking free. <laughs> Here, run towards your shit. <laughs> They're gonna kill you. Okay, how was it? Terrifying. <laughs> Update, Garage and I are currently taking Instagram photos because that's what we do best. <laughs> photos here, 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 here. Outfit change number two, going to the beach. Also packing for Manila, Garage at least. And I'm moving to my hostel. Mm. Hi! We're heading to Barceloneta. But also my hostel, so. Vamos y sin censura, yo te hago todo a ti dulzura. Que paso en ti, yo solo cuenta todo. Y si tú quieres, te pone a buscar. Es como tú lo mueves a pa pam pam. Haciendo locura en la mañana. Si alguien te pregunta, no apasiona. Solo amaneciste en mi cama. Dale, besame. Ven y atrápame. Hagamos jueguitos. Good morning vlog. It is my second day. Is it my second day? Well, technically it's my third day in Barcelona, but my second day exploring because I got here on the first day really, really late, so I didn't get to do anything. Um, now I'm just having a day to myself to explore because Garage left yesterday. Okay, so um, last night I was supposed to go out with the people that I met from the hostel, but then I realized that I really need to get up early today and I really want to see Barcelona. I only have one day here. So, one full day, I mean. Uh, I don't 
really want to spend my time here drinking alcohol and spending extra, you know? I don't know, I feel, I don't feel old, honestly. I feel like I have my priorities straight. That's the only thing I'm gonna say. I have three days here. So priority is Gaudi and not tequila. love about Gaudi architecture is that there is nothing like it in the world and yet the city of Barcelona is kind of built around it this, it's what it's known for and his work is just everywhere and very much like nature you see how the walls curve and how the pillars turn and see this is living proof that you don't have to be a finished work to be a masterpiece oh my god I just said that I said that so I think after this, I'm going to check out Casa, Mi Casa Mila and Casa Batlo. Is it Batlo? I don't know. Wait, I need to correct that too. Yeah, it's within walking distance at around 11.30. I'm going to meet up with a friend for brunch. So uh, I should have time to walk around and explore a little bit more. The best part about exploring on a Sunday morning is that there are barely any people. <laughs> Out and about. No tourists, no locals, everyone's asleep. Only early wakers, which is great because sometimes I can be that. Here we are, ladies and gents. This is amazing because I realized that all the lower ground spaces are actually being utilized as commercial spaces. That's amazing because I don't think we have something similar in Manila at least. I know the old buildings are not being used. But can you imagine if all the old spaces in old Manila were to be restored? How amazing would that be? Oh my god, it's so big. purchase of the day oh god can I see so we have the Swarovski crystal Swarovski. Squirrel. and amber oh I think a amber Paul <laughs> yeah comment below <laughs> So I just finished having lunch. Well, actually, I spent the entire day with Andy, which was great. Um, I honestly plan on just having lunch with her, but we ended up having so much fun just talking, and she showed me around Barcelona. Oh, the best. Better than a San Domenes tour. So we finally uh, parted ways, and she told me to go to Castle Montjuic uh, for sunset, and so I'm going there now. Yeah, this trip was lovely. Thank you, Andy. Esos breves de tus pasos se acercan Tú me debes una noche con maldad Yo soy preso de esos besos y tu piel Yo sé que eso Oh no, I just got rejected. <laughs> it's closed inside. Oh well, I could probably see it from there. It's fine. <laughs> they panicked when I just walked in and they were like, no, 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 it's closed, it's closed. I'm sorry. <laughs> You 
You guys, I think this may be the most beautiful area I've been to all day. It's gorgeous, like full of palm trees. And then the view of Barcelona is right there. I don't know if you can see it from here, but it's gorgeous. I feel like I'm invading a moment. I'm sorry. Good morning! It's day number three in Barcelona and I have a bus at 11.30 so I need to be back in like an hour and a half back to the hostel to pack and check out but for now I'm just heading to the beach so I can enjoy, so I can enjoy the sun and the sand and the sea well not the sea because it's really freaking cold apparently I haven't been in the water but I just need to sunbathe, get that tan and then head back to Madrid huh. Good day, what a good day, I'm lost, okay, oh. There's no one at the beach, this is amazing. But also, it's a Monday morning. Everyone's either asleep, working, or just probably more sane. I've pretty much just been sunbathing and reading Sapiens. I've been trying to read this for the longest time, but I just feel like with everything happening at work, I couldn't really read something non-fiction and educational. Just because I, I feel like I'm always rushing and having so much information, it's just too much for me because of all the work and all the thinking that I do. But now that I finally get to have this weekend to myself in Barcelona, and I get to sit down and just read and just relax, it's really amazing. This is exactly why I want to do YouTube full time and this is why I want to have my own business. Not because it's less work, but because it would give me the creative and financial independence that I've always wanted and that I've always been working towards. I want to be able to travel and I want to be able to not necessarily escape but you know just see more and do more and not feel like I'm always rushing or I'm always trying to complete a checklist. Although with my personality I know that that's going to be the, my default setting. I feel like I'm always going to be looking for something more to do but I want to be able to just drop stuff and give myself a break when I need to. And to me, it's always summer, it's always warmth, it's always the sea, it's always gonna be, I'm always gonna be sun kissed somewhere. And it's just, I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I just, I, I feel really happy that I'm where I am now and that I'm doing what I do now and I'm going to do what I want to do in the next couple of months, in the next year probably. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna be back in Manila. I'm going to try to pursue my happiness, my creative freedom, and my financial independence. Is that adulthood? Maybe it is. Anyway, I'm heading back to Madrid soon, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Stay confident. Bye. No, no.